Hi there, I'm Kim Weber with the Gimpy Gourmet, and in this episode, we're gonna be making a basic cookie batter with some add-ins. We've, we've picked four add-ins to go in these because they're gonna be special cookies. But the first thing we need to do is cream butter and sugar, and we've got brown sugar and white sugar in this bowl of our standing mixer with two sticks of room temperature butter. The next thing we're gonna add are two eggs. We're gonna add these one at a time. So let's plop the this is this is an art. <laughs> Being able to do that. I never knew how hard it was to so try. It. So anyway, let's get one going. Okay, we added the second egg, got it beaten into that, really incorporated well. We're gonna add the last of our wet ingredients, which is one tablespoon of real vanilla extract, not vanilla flavoring, but vanilla extract. So let's get that incorporated and we'll be back and start with the dry ingredients. Okay, so it's several times when I was beating that together and I was incorporating it, I went ahead and scraped the bowl down with the spatula. Um, that just ensures that all of your ingredients get really incorporated well. So now we're gonna add our dry ingredients, which are some all-purpose flour, about a cup and three quarters, a tablespoon, no, a teaspoon of salt, right? And a half teaspoon of baking soda. And so we'll go ahead and add that in. And let's add that in about a half cup at a time. I've got a quarter cup measure here. And let's add that in about a half cup at a time. And we'll be back when we get it all incorporated. So we're back, it's time to put in the add-ins. We're gonna put in four cups of add-ins today. <laughs> it's chopped macadamia nuts, some dried cranberries, some little tiny orange slice candy that's been cubed up very carefully, and white chocolate chips. So we're gonna add that to our well incorporated cookie batter, and we'll be back with you when we get that finished. Okay, we're using an ice cream scoop. I've got a cookie scoop about the same size, but the ice cream scoop is just easier for me to use. And it, you know, by using one of these scoops, be it a cookie scoop or an ice cream scoop, you get a uniform size of cookie. And these are pretty generous cookies. You want them to be a little bit big so you can get a bite of everything. And you can get about, when they're this size, you get about five of them to a sheet. So we've got them on parchment paper. We're gonna put them in a 350 oven for about 12 minutes. And we'll be back when we take them out of the oven and let you see what they look like.
here's what happened to the cookies <laughs> from the time they left the mixer till the time they ended up on the tray. You saw that we scooped them out with an ice cream scoop, put them five to a cookie sheet, baked them for about 10 minutes, looked at them, made sure they were, you know, brown, but not too brown, took them out, let them stay on the cookie sheet on top of the stove for five minutes. They continued to cook while on the cookie sheet. Then we take them off and transfer them to a baking rack where you keep them for about another five minutes and then you can eat them or whatever you want to do with them. And one, all in all, this recipe made 24 cookies, which is exactly what it should make. And this is 21 of them. Just say it. <laughs> so anyway, this is a great cookie recipe. You know, we're, we're We've got new neighbors and we're going to be giving some cookies away and doing some things like that. So these were the things that we thought would be a good treat. And then it'll be New Year's. So anyway, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give us a thumbs up. We'd like for you to subscribe. Hit that little bell when you subscribe. That way you'll be notified whenever we put up new videos. We're going to try to do them about twice a week. We're going to do some, next we're going to do some product reviews and some things like that. So, you know, we're going to try to do, give you a variety of things on the Give You Gourmet. But we hope that you like this. We hope that you'll come back and see it. We want to thank you for spending a little bit Just of your time with us. And as Warren Zevon says, enjoy every sandwich. To you. The apple of somebody's eye Be that honey pie So let's talk about what happened to the cookies after they left the mixer and before they ended up on the beautiful tray. So the first thing... <laughs> <laughs> what? Walter! Walter was a cookie! <laughs> let's leave him in the field. Let's leave him in. Okay. Walter would Walter's like make, a cookie. making noises. He's making noise and we can't do anything about it. This is Walter. He thinks that one of these cookies is for him and he's very wrong. <laughs>